Yo. What up, though? What up, though? What up, though? What up, gangster? What you saying, my guy? We don't play around. <laughs> we don't play around. How you doing, though? I'm alright, bro. You feeling good, yeah? One's been hitting the gym and that. You know Fam, what I'm I can tell, bro. I can you? tell. I like, can tell, like, the that's, chest is all over the place. That's right what now, motivates bro. me, you know. Is it? When someone can see that. Man's been working out. Yeah, yeah, of course, of course, of course. Of you know course. what I'm saying? Of course, like, the thing is, when you're hitting the gym and everything, yeah, the process is not sweet. It's never sweet. Yeah, but once you start seeing the result, Ooh, everything, bro. You know when you come out of the gym and then you go to the changing room? Everyone does it. I don't care what you say. I yeah. know everyone does it. Do what? You go to the changing room, bro. You go stand in front of me, flex your muscles. Yeah, of course, bro. To, you want to check me. yourself out. Of course, bro. You need to see the progress, bro. Of course, bro. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah you get yeah, me? Yeah, yeah. But why is it that we always tell each other, yo, fam, I'm trying to be like you, bro. You get, <laughs> you get me? At the gym, though. You get bro. me? Bro, that is the standard. That is the standard. Hello. Yo, fam, you're looking good, bro. Fam, I'm trying to be like you, bro. bro these times, <laughs> if anyone tells me that, I don't even, I'm like, in my head, I'm like, fuck off. Is it? Because, bro, people just say for saying sake bro of course bro that's what i'm saying that's what i'm saying you get me you know? like fam like the one that pissed me off is you see this guy he 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 is so big like the fucking incredible hulk he's looking at this other guy some skinny ass dude and everything he's like, fam, 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 I'm trying to be like you bro <laughs> like what the fuck is going on no, no, here we bro? need to be real for once you guys I'm nah, gonna bro, i love it though i'm not gonna lie. i do that too bro. i do it i'm guilty of it too bro you get it, it's it's a form of motivating each other. That's just it? what it is, bro. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's just what it is. I ain't trying to be like you. If you're smaller than me, if you're skinnier than me. I'm not trying to be I'm like you, bro. I'm not trying to be like you. <laughs> 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 you know what I'm saying? But well, you're looking good, bro, man. No, I'm not going front. Holiday season, isn't it? So yeah. man, man's trying to put in the work. Fam, it seems like hoodie season is back, bro. Bro. Hoodie bro. season is back. Was it not a few days ago, I should Everyone say. was talking about it's too hot. We are putting on vests and t-shirts and topless fam, and shit fam do you know how many times i've contemplated coming on this podcast um <laughs> fucking shirtless bro bro don't do that no, no, no. <laughs> don't do that no, don't no, do that no 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 bro i'm talking about in the summertime because of how hot it was i here, know bro. i know if I know. fam it was too crazy but now bro like like the, bro. the hoodies are creeping out now bro. but i kind of like this weather though it's not bad though yeah yeah because yeah. like today was in the mid teens. It was. It's not. It's not. It's not too hot. It's not too hot. It's not yeah, too cold in it. Yeah, yeah. I yeah. kind of liked it. Yeah. No. 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 It's. This is my type of weather and everything. Mm, yeah. Mm, Some mm. crazy shit happened this afternoon, bro. Right. Wait, 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 you wait, know. What happened? What happened, bro? Man, obviously went downstairs, innit? You get me? I had just just my my um my vest on. You know, my vest and my shorts and everything. You get me? Because the gas engineer he he came around and everything to oh, fix okay. something and all that. You know. And you know, my neighbors here are all white people, bruv. <laughs> you get what I'm saying? And they are mad nosy, fam. Is it? Shit. So, so we were just downstairs just checking out some things and all that, yeah? Some some old white man just walked up to us. Two black guys, innit? Walk up to us, hey. Who are you? What are you doing here? What the hell? I swear to God. So I looked at him. I said, who are you? <laughs> so he said, I leave here. I said, no, you don't. So he said to me, you don't leave here. I said, no, yeah, I do. So I said to him, you don't leave you here. You don't live here. You get me? He said, no, no, I do. I said, where do you leave? He said, I, I live on house one. Mm. Right? So I said, because I know the people that live there. I said, okay, who are the people that live there? Because you don't live there. He said, oh, because, you know, I'm here to see this and this person. So right? he, he don't even live here. So he do, he does not even live here. About I live he here. You know what I'm saying? Know. But the thing is, he saw two black guys. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah you yeah, get yeah, me? Yeah. And one of the black guys is obviously hench, isn't it? Mm -hmm. You get me? So he's probably thinking, what, what, what is what, You know what I'm saying? They, what, they, they're trying to... <laughs> What are these black boys in here? You guys say nah, the audacity, you know. Bro, so some he, racist undertone in there. Bro, nah, bro. that is not acceptable because he does not even live in the building. Hey, he is the father of one of the guys. 
He don't give that him came no to visit. Right. If he don't know you, he don't know you. He should go ask his son. Exactly, bro. You get me? You get me, but it just one of them ones where, where he, he probably just saw this guy who's... Yeah, who's you've got you know, tattoos. He got, yeah, no, exactly. He, exactly, bro. You know, so he's probably thinking, yeah. this guy, does and this guy they, belong, belong in this neighborhood? And they, and they survey, then they survey the area for yeah, Mission Impossible. Exactly, bro. Nah, I hate them things, man. You get what I'm saying? Like, he probably saw saw the size of me and everything and, and then fought for to us, you know, I'm gonna ask a question, bro. I'm like thinking at the back of my mind, you're lucky that that like I was in a good mood, bro. Yeah, yeah, I would have yeah, pressed yeah. you easy. Yeah, or just ignore him, man. You guys say. But it's good you asked him back. You don't live here too. Like yeah, I, I said to him, bro, you don't live here, bro. <laughs> yeah, you get what I'm saying? But yeah, man. But yeah, it's been it's been I'm not gonna lie, it's been a good one. It's been a good one. So, you know, so, this this so, so. you know, the last ep- episode the last obviously episode was fire. Shit, bro. You it wasn't was, here and it everything. Was, I was in here, man, but I've watched it. I've watched it. Very yeah. very educative. Nah, like, nah, nah, uh, nah. She was you good, know, man. Yeah, I heard a lot of things that you know it it, it enlarges your 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 knowledge about the whole about music the whole, in yeah. general, you know. Yeah. yeah. And then also it kind of helps you appreciate the work that goes into, into yeah. what this guy is doing. 100. Do everything, 100. It's not just about the artist, my guy. It's not just about the artist. Yeah. The logistics behind Bro, it and everything. It's crazy. Yeah. No, the guy, the guy is a bit talk. It's a bit yeah. gentle like, guy, though. Very, like, very, very, very tell. gentle guy. He's not like the typical Niger man. <laughs> what do you mean the typical Niger man? You did crazy. <laughs> but yeah, man, it, it, listen, it was a good one. You know, in the comments, everyone is talking about, yo, we want to see MD. You should yeah, bring on bro. MD and everything. But first of all, what we're going to say is shout out to... Tell me that your bruv. Big shout you know out. I mean? Respect shout my out guy. to you, my guy. I wasn't here to pay my respects, like but show yeah, you my yeah, respect, yeah, yeah, yo. Yeah. Salute to him and everything. And and listen, you guys relax, man. MD MD's gonna MD come will up. Come. He will come. You get me? He MD will, will come. come up. Trust me on that one. Yeah. He will. Something is in the works, something's in the pipeline. Yeah, yeah. When Toby says it, believe that. Believe that. that. Believe you, that. You, you get me? See, you know, fam, and, and, and we're getting a lot of you know calls right now, people talking about yo, we like come up and everything, bruv. You get me, but someone come ask me some one question, bro. Say, yo, how come it's only guys that are coming up, bro? How about the ladies, bro? <laughs> true, but not true though, bro. But we had a couple ladies on the pod back in the day. That was like about two years ago. That was there, a while bro. Back. Any, any. You day. know what? It's crazy though because we went through a period where we were not kind of open to guests. To guests, yeah, for a while, for, for a, a long while, while. for yeah, a yeah, long yeah. while. You know yeah. what I'm saying? But that was because we wanted to build this around us. Yeah. You know, we didn't want it to be like a guest based, based pod. podcast. You even now, saying? so even now we're mixing and matching it. Like, exactly. You get me? A guest will come, a guest won't come. Like, yeah. We're just, it's, it's still all about us. Yeah. You, you know, know, so so it just one of them ones. But, but the ladies will start coming up. We I have a couple, a couple ladies in the yeah, pipeline. Yeah, yeah, make them come, make them come. You go, I mean, so that they come. We, we need to refresh. You get me? We need oh, yeah. to refresh the pot. Yeah, some spices and that. We need that, to yeah. see some flowers on the pot. Yeah, some spices and that. Too much yeah. testosterone. <laughs> <laughs> you got know I me? Mean? Nah, nah, I see we've got a lot of lady viewers as well. I'm sure yeah. they would appreciate it. Listen, listen, listen. Shout out to them, though. You know, yeah. yeah. Shout yeah. out to them. Shout out to them. Shout out to them. Nah, bro. You know, very soon the ladies will start coming up to represent the ladies too, man. Mm-hmm. You go, know I mean, we won that. We champion the ladies here and all that, bro. You know what I'm saying? 100, 100%. Yeah, well, yeah, man. We definitely do, man. You know? But, bro. Walk on, walk on, walk on. Listen, I've been thinking, bro. We might be going back to Africa soon, you know? What do you mean we might be going back to Africa soon? Because I saw the news well, and everything. Oh, bro. shit. <laughs> I saw on the news and everything. You get me? Kim, it was his name, Kim Jong Un, or whatever his name is. That <laughs> I've never known how to pronounce that guy's name. I think you got it right, Kim Jong Un. Yeah, yeah, Kim Jong Un, and and Putin shaking hands and that. I say, yo, <laughs> World War Three is on the rising, nah, bro. No, 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 it not go up. You don't think so? It not go up. Not in this century, bro. You don't think so? Nah, the powers above will make sure it doesn't. It doesn't happen. Cause. I know go up here, no go Every up. day we go to bed, I'm thinking, bro, we might be waking up to some Dude, bombs and shit, bro. <laughs> Serious, who? Serious. Because, I mean, because if if the West, you know, keeps on pressing and supplying this whole thing with Ukraine and everything, hey, Russia might be like, fuck it. Unless if something happens to Putin. They need alibis, though. I see. I hear that. 
shaking hands with Fingy and that, but they won't get involved. Fam, if anything happens, bro, I'm sure North Korea will want to jump in. China might want to jump in. Jump in, but on whose side? Russia, obviously. Bro, I don't think they will get involved. They will get in that mix. With, I know they support Russia, but I don't think they will actually, when it, when it, when shit hits the fan at that point, they would. Uh, you don't think so? I don't think they will back them like that. Shit, I think so, bro. Because they've got no business backing them. Like, they've got no business in this war. I think if they see, I don't know, bro. I don't, I don't know, but if they see that there is a big, big opportunity here in them taking over, if they see, listen, if we get involved, we can fucking decimate maybe NATO or the West or wherever, I think they'll probably do it. Yeah, World War Three not go up in a big. You think yeah. so? No, 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 no. Like I'm not a politician. Obviously, I don't want it to happen. But I, but I'm just saying, bro. You know, in case it go up, go if you pack Martin, go to Nigeria. Jail. Pack, you get time pack. <laughs> <laughs> just get your passport. If you got me. Just get your passport straight to Nigeria, Boom, straight, don't bro. Don't worry, don't worry. Uh, you get these days, man, don't even keep cash anymore. Everything is in your bank account. That's Every, what matters. Man, everything is your you bank know, account, bro. I'm telling you. I know you, you got a couple, you got a couple Yeezys and designer trainers and that. that you're gonna miss that, but bro. But fuck it. Fuck it. <laughs> <laughs> fuck it. No, fuck it, bro. Just you run. Know what I'm because just one of them one lie. I'm just thinking about the whole thing, fake it, boy. I hope this shit doesn't happen, man. I don't think it's I'm I'm very optimistic. I hope it's so. Not gonna I hope so. I hope so. Because Bro, we're not ready for it. We're definitely not ready for that shit, bro. But anywho's, fam, should we start this, yeah? Before we already did, bro. Yes, sir. Listen, 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 listen. Welcome, welcome, welcome back to another episode of Fresh Off The Boat Show slash podcast. Whichever way you want to call it, bro. You get know what I'm saying? You guys can be anywhere in the world, but you're right here with us. Mm-hmm. Salute to all the freshers out there, bro. You get know what I mean? Listen, 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 listen. This episode is powered by yours truly, Toby and Kojo, man. Kelly's not here today, man. Big you go what I'm saying? He's on a mission. Gaga. As always, bruv. You go what I'm saying? But salute to him wherever he is, man. Listen, if you've not subscribed to the channel, do that right now. Subscribe to the channel. Watch the videos. Leave a like. Leave a comment. Share it. Tell a friend to tell a friend. Oh, tell an enemy to tell a friend because they got friends too yep. you go know i'm saying and also we are on your audio platforms as well you go know i mean on spotify apple amazon google anywhere where you find us we did there man we did you know what i'm saying for, for 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 some of you that love the audio experience and everything bruv you know what i'm saying we are there mm-hmm. you get me mm-hmm. you know and listen 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 if you've not if you're not subscribed yet i don't know what you're waiting for right now Hit that subscribe button, bruv. You go, I'm saying. Hit that two subscribe seconds. Button, two seconds. You go, I'm saying. And also, you can follow us on Instagram. It's right there on the screen. Yep. You go, I'm saying. Support the movement. Support the movement. Yeah, follow, bruv. comment, share it, like it. Tell your people. Everyone, bruv. Subscribe. You know? Just Let's get this platform support, booming, bro. Support, bruv. support, support. You get me? And once again, thank you for everyone that have been doing it, though. Yeah, yeah. Because some of you have been going hard and everything, sharing on Twitter and everything i say i read the comments and everything salute to you guys and some of you guys are also shady man you go i mean posting our video without, without cc our name in there bro i see it, bro i see some of them on twitter fam. i beg you, you go post you don't need to tag us just tag the just platform. put the name there just fresh put the name the fresh of the boat podcast man we see the videos i just see them i just laugh some of them just put it you get me, but when they post a bigger platform, guess what they do? They put the name they there. They put the bro. name there. You get me. So why go post anyway? Hey, listen, it's all good, bro. Support, it's support good. the as movement, people. As long as you guys are sharing it, bro. That's all that matters, fam. You get me, fam. Should we do this? Yeah. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. A word for the wise. A word for the wise. I just was running, and I was on my grind. You see what I'm saying? I was on my grind, and it just was like, you know, when you and your grind, like me, I'm one of them dudes like this, bro. I got to secure my finances because if I don't win, my, you know, I got to take care of my family, taking care of people. So it was like, I'd lock in some time and I, and I, you know, I'm putting that first, you know, I'm putting, I'm putting this, I'm putting that before everything. You see what I'm saying? So sometimes, you know, you know, we out here living in a time where women want to be in competition with your dreams. And I'm not saying that was the case with her, 
But I wasn't even going to let it get that far. But, you know, it is what it is. But go ahead, what you competition with your dreams? I like that. No, motherfuckers be in competition in this day in this day and game with the gram. You know, a chick could tell you, you better chase me like you chase your money. That's not happening, baby. You got your life fucked up. Not me. Not me. Not Wallow Two Six Seven, aka Wallace Peebles. That would never happen. But you know they just be testing a nigga when they, they say that. They ain't shit. testing me. Test somebody else. Go to get me. Damn, go to, go to school and take a test, baby. You ain't gonna do that shit with me. Yes, sir. But this ain't. It's not happening with me. All that. Oh yeah. No. No, Cause, baby cause girl. Because the truth be, a woman, a real woman, don't even want that. Nah. Yeah. They ain't, you know they just be saying that shit. Nah. I mean, motherfucker, want a motherfucker to come up and then fall back and chill. No, nah, I'm not laying up nowhere with nobody. I'm going to get this paper. Yes, yeah. sir. The flight come, yeah, yeah. We, we, we on a flight tomorrow morning. We got to go handle this business. Right. I mean, you see what's going on. We, we, me and Ty was talking about seven in the morning. You know what I mean? We early in the morning to get this shit done. I'm not every, and I'm not going to be in no situation where a person questioning me, babe, why you, fuck you mean? Why, why what? The first time you say why this and the third, when it comes to my business, you're done. It's over. Mm. I don't play that shit. Even Man, mm. I had to do 20 years in prison. Come home, put my ground, do all the research in jail. Come home, put my ground down. You think I'm slow enough for you? Mm. No, we not. We ain't on the same time. If you even going to uh, insinuate some shit like that, like we need more time. We gonna have time. Let me. You ever watch? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. We need this more is, time. This is a word for the wise, bro. If you go, I'm saying. Word for the wise, yeah, enough. bro. For some of you man out there, man, Yo. you go. I mean, go for your grind. Go for the papers, bro. You go. I'm saying. Trust me, the ladies will always they come, will bro. Come. You, you go. I'm saying. She wants me to chase her like the way I chase my paper. Nah, nah man, bro. Nah, nah bro. <laughs> like my mama always say, bro. The beautiful ones are not yet born, nah, bro. Nah, it's not fifty-fifty. I'm not putting that. I'm not putting in that same effort. We gotta go. God, listen, I'm after the paper, I'm and then, the paper then, first, and then what you get what I'm saying. That's it, brother. And then you will come. That's it, brother. You Jeez. get me? Let's go. Yeah, 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 yeah. Rest in peace to Mobad. R.I.P. 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 R. R. to R. the young girl, bro. R.I.P. to him, bro. Gone listen. too soon. Gone too fucking soon. Gone too soon, bro. How many times? How many times? How many fucking times, bro? Bro, listen. This is the part of podcasting that I don't like. Hmm. This is the part of podcasting that I hate doing. Having conversations like this, bro. Pain, you know what I'm saying? Because for the most part, podcasting to me, I don't know about anyone else, it's like a therapeutic thing, isn't it? You get me? Just mm, coming, mm, you mm. know, after a long day or whatever, you get me? And just coming and just have a good time, mm -hmm. just crack jokes and mm -hmm. everything. And it sucks that um, we have to come in and have these sort of conversations, bruv. You get what I'm saying? You know? And um, the last two days, I've been in a very, 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 I wouldn't say bad mood, but I've not really been happy. You know what I'm saying? What do I mean by that? Now, I'm not going to see here to say that I am very, very familiar with this guy's catalog and mm. I'm talking about Mobad. Mm. I'm mm. not going to see here and say I'm the biggest Mobad fan and yeah. everything and I knew everything. I know some songs. You know what I'm saying? You know, I know some songs, watched them from a distance, cool guy. You know what I'm saying? You know, but then about, I believe it was about two days ago, I saw it went through my timeline that he's dead, mm. right? I was like, shit, that Lee. But then it started like, like a fucking storm. It started coming in, it started coming in, it started coming in. Then the next thing I saw was, oh, he died from an ear infection. What the fuck? Huh. Ear infection? I was trying to see, okay, he got me see more information about this whole ear infection what, what thing. What kind of, how many? I'm, uh, yeah, right. like I'm not the sharpest tool in the, in the drawer or, or in the box. But I was thinking. And to me, that doesn't even make sense. When ear infections start to kill people. You know what I'm saying? To me, that doesn't even make sense. Then I announced there's seen different articles, you know, pointing fingers at some same people. Mm. You know what I'm saying? I'm not going to lie. 
I did not know that shit like that was going on. Bro, I didn't even know, bro. bro. You sh- yeah. You get me? Like news news never surfaces until tragedy. Tragedy strikes, isn't it? Bro, until it's, it's too late. Until it's too late. Until it's too late. That's when boxes start popping open. New, like, what? You get me? Cause some of the videos that I saw. There was a video that I saw, yeah, of this guy was with Zlatan mm. shooting a music video. I don't know if you saw that. Mm-mm, mm-mm. All of a sudden, this this dude with his dogs walked in and started harassing the guy. Music video. Someone was recording this shit. God damn. You know what I mean? Somebody was literally recording this bullshit. You get me? I saw another one where he was in the car. They probably beat him up at the time and everything. His cloak was kind of torn. You yeah, get yeah, me? Yeah, I think I've seen that I one. I saw that. His clothes were ripped up. And yeah. Stopped. I saw another one. Bro, I started seeing bare disturbing shit. Then, then I started seeing videos of him when he was already dead in the car. You get me? His boy was crying and everything. Bro, I started seeing a lot of shit. And I was saying, cars. They run the music labels over there like some, they are like on some mafia shit, bro. Like, apparently, apparently, from what the articles are saying, because I do not know, he signed a deal with, I mean, this is a public thing, so there's no point not even saying not it. Saying it yeah. He signed a deal with Naira um label. Um, label. Right? Mm, mm, mm. And then whatever happened, he decided to come off the deal. He said he doesn't want to be in the deal no more, right? And from from all the things I'm gathering, that's where that, that was when his problem started. Started. He got me. I saw his exchange. Um, um, I saw his tweets. He got me where he said that he went to speak to to Naramali at his studio, wherever the place is, and, and him him and his friends went there and they got beat up and all that kind of stuff. Naramali came out, did a video talking about the guy was on drugs, that the guy doesn't know what the fuck he's talking about shit. The guy replied him on Twitter, said, nah, that's not true. You know, he's at the hospital right now, he got injured and all that shit. You know what I'm saying? So you oh. have all this going on. I saw another video of of the guy's dad, he came to speak to Naira Mali. Naira Mali was lying on top of a bed or a sofa, and the guy's dad was standing over there, sort of pleading. And Naira Mali was telling the guy's dad how the guy, you know, he's not coherent and, and he's on drugs and all that bullshit. Bro, it was sickening to see what's going on. Bro, that is bro. deep, you know. It was sickening to see, yeah, that what we say. That the white man does to us. Black people are doing it to their fellow black yeah, people. Yeah, bro, it's mad. In this day and century, after everything that we, we it's know. It's crazy, bro. Everything we've seen, everything we've experienced. Bro, they are literally running a mafia-style shit over there. I started hearing stories about, I, I believe it was Runtown, some of that people that have been through similar shit. So if you sign a contract... And, and for whatever reason, you feel that the contract is not too good for you anymore or whatever, and you want to come out, they literally will brutalize you and, and harass you and everything, bruv. You got what I'm saying? Which is the reason why some artists, we see here and we wonder why mm, their mm. career did not go a certain mm-hmm, way, mm-hmm, but we don't know mm-hmm. what's going on behind the scenes. Mm-hmm. They are being bullied into signing contracts that, like, deep down, yeah. it's not beneficial to them. It's not beneficial to them, bruv. And we don't, we don't know. We don't, we don't know. It's crazy, bro. All we know is their music. So we're thinking, right, like, what, what's going on with this guy? But, bro, and if you're in that situation, bro, your music is not, you're not even going to put your heart and soul in, in making your music. Fam, these guys are using political talks. These people are using political talks to harass people, bro. Now, I'm not saying, obviously, I don't know what happened. I'm not saying Naramali did anything. I don't know. You're going by what you've seen, isn't it? I'm just the going by some of the things, some of the videos that I've that seen, seen. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Right? On social media. Yeah. This particular guy, 
He's hanging around with governors. He's hanging around with the, with the current president. I saw the video and everything. You get what I'm saying? And this guy walks around with thugs and he went to that video shoot, right? To harass Mobat. The video is right there on During the internet. During a video right? shoot. Doing a video shoot with Zlatan. It was Zlatan that saved Mobat. That is mental. Because Mobad is a kid, bro. Yeah, yeah, he's a young guy. He's like 24, I think maybe 24, 27, thereabout. Young guy, young guy. Young he's guy, a kid, man. bro. You get me? Who's trying to find a way? He's still maneuvering in the whole, in the industry. Fam, he's trying to find a way to provide for his family. He just had a kid. You get what I'm saying? She's trying to find a way to provide for his family and everything. He probably didn't, does, does not have the, you know, the, the power or the talk to go toe to toe with some of these with people. Some of these, no, 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 no. Go, I, I mean, mean, they're bullying and everything, and now the boy is dead. You get me? And they're trying to come out to say, oh, he had an ear infection and everything, and then boom, he got apparently, not apparently, he got buried the next day. So no autopsy was, was done. No autopsy was done, right? He got buried the next day. And the way he was buried, bro, I saw that I dropped a tear, bro. Fucking hell. I dropped a tear. He was put in a coffin because he looks like he's a tall dude, right? He was put in a coffin. That's not his size. They had to break his neck. Bro, you're joking. On God in heaven, bro. They had to break his neck to fit him in the coffin, bro. Golly. I had to, I, I shed a tear for the guy. Where you bro. go see that one? It's, it's everywhere on the internet, bro. Twitter and everything. The people that were there at the burial and all that shit, bro. The burial was just, they, they just had to dig, dig a hole and just put him in there. He gone because the family does not have money. Shout out to Davido from the article that I saw. Davido sent his dad, they family, I, I believe it was two. Million naira, something like that. So shout, shout out again, bro. Hmm. Shout out. To him. You got what I'm saying? Some, some of the industry people came to the barrier and all that shit. You know, bro. The, that was a video and everything. Bonner boy was, I believe, in a studio or in a club or whatever, and 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 he was on life and everything. And on the life. People were saying, rest in peace, more bad, rest in peace, more bad. Like, he did not even believe it, bro. He looked at it. He looked yeah, at he, it again, like, what the fuck? So he had to call his boy to come say, yo, is this really, verify, really happening? Is that true? Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Nobody believed it, bro. But the thing is, the boy has videos online saying, this is what he said. He said, yo, if anything happens to me, it is Naira Mali, and the Malian comp uh, company or whatever it is. That was what, he has a video. He has a video saying that. If, you know, they've been bullying me, they've been harassing me and everything. If if I die, if anything happens to me, please hold Naira Mali and the Malian whatever accountable. That's why people are going at him like that. that bro, Mali. his comments are crazy. People are going at him. Just before we started, now I don't know, but just before we started, I saw allegedly that that he has been he, he has been arrested with the other guy. What's the other guy's name? Sam Larry. Sam Larry. Sam Larry. Yeah, that the both of them have been arrested to um to be questioned. I don't know if it's true. I don't know, but that's what I saw on the on, on the internet. Fuck me. You know Bro. what I'm saying? And me me personally, I think everybody connected to him should be arrested, right? And questioned. But the thing is, bro, they didn't even do an autopsy to prove the what cause happened? of his death. That's my point. So right now, it's like, it's hearsay, hearsay, because apparently when he got to the hospital, the nurses tested him and then they thought it was malaria. And then later on, they were like, no, it's not malaria. Now others are saying, yeah, infection. Some are saying, and some of the nurses are even saying it was, it was, it was um, all these spiritual it was a spiritual bro, death. It's just, it's just everyone is guessing at this point, bro. But redone autopsy is like, bro, they go arrest you, arrest you, but there's what evidence? Like that, that, the body's that is not even point. there to say, to look at it and then say, 
he was harmed here, he was beaten up, or this was in his, I mean, in his bloodstream, like he had died in his... You, you don't know. I honestly think that they need to dig up his body and do an autopsy. If, if that was a functioning country, there is absolutely no way that boy, with all the evidence, with all those evidences online, right? Bro, there are videos online. You know what I mean? There are videos of this guy screaming for help. There are videos of this guy being harassed. And to me, that was what pained me because I was looking at him thinking, golly, you know, he went through all this. A part of me just kind of wished that he won. You know what I mean? A part of me kind of wished that he won. He won in the end. You know what I mean? Because at the moment I look at him, he, I feel like he lost. Yes, he's at peace right now, but yeah, I kind of feel like yeah, he yeah. lost. This... Whoever it is, got the last laugh. Yeah, 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 yeah. You go. Know I mean, and to me, that's for a reason why some people, when they come out, yeah, and they get to the top, and people are saying, "No, nah, you guys are you are proud right now. You're not." Da, 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 da. Fam, you don't know what don't, they went through, you don't bro. No, you don't know their struggles. You don't know what they've. Been you don't through. know what they went through. You don't know what they've suffered. The abuse they've suffered what they've actually sacrificed to get to where they got to. You don't know. Like nah, bro, this one pay me. Bro, if the guy made it, I, I get what you're saying. It's, you know what I'm it's, saying? Bro, it's sad. It's, that's wickedness. Whatever they done, whoever done it. It's wickedness, that is bro. wickedness, bro. There's too much food for everyone to eat. Like, why? Why? Why if, take somebody in life? If the guy does not want to be with your label, okay. Bro, come on. Like, let him let go. Him walk. You're doing really well. You've got other artists signed to your label. Let him walk, man. But but the thing is, it's just a place where there is no law. The law is not being enforced and everything. People just feel like they can just walk all around people. That basically what's going on over there. You get what I mean? Because there's absolutely no reason why some people like that, like that dude that came to the video and wanted to harass him, they should not have bro, that they can't, type of they power. They can't bro. do that in every corner they of the world. They can't do that here. They can't do it here and get away scot-free. You can't you know, do it here. You just go harass somebody... And then that's Are you it. mad? And then the person, bro, come on. A kid for that matter, though. You're doing that to a kid. You get me? And and I always say, I always say that the cowards, they run in packs. Yeah, they yeah, run in yeah, numbers. Yeah, yeah. You go, I'm saying, that yeah. dude, one-to-one -one fight, he might not be able to fight. He might not yeah, even last no, two no, minutes. No, no. That's the only way they you can You go, I'm effective. saying, he will run out of breath. Go in packs and then go... Go harass people, fuck somebody everything. up, and then and then that's that's. Ah oh, no no no! The team pay me, bro. The team the team pay me. You get me, and 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 he pay me because I was seeing everything, bro. But at the back of my mind, I'm thinking. So you lot knew all this, and everyone kept quiet. Everybody kept quiet. That's absolutely no way you guys can say the people that are in the industry. Some of you knew this shit was they going must, on. They must have known. They must have known, bro. There is absolutely no way it's, if they it's proven. If if it's online, if all these videos are online, if all this shit happened and then there's evidence of it, they must have known. Come guy, he must that, have been talking to people. He must have complained. He must have. Yeah, of course. You get me? But then they shut him up. Like you said, there is no law. There is no shut him up. There is no protection. There is there's nothing protecting the industry, protecting... People in that industry, general people, there's nothing. People do shit and get away with it like it's like it's it's normal. My own thing is, if people know for sure, yeah, that the thing that happened to this kid directly came from whoever it came from, yeah, that person should pay for that shit. There is no way they should allow that person to still operate in this industry in the Afrobeats. No. Nah. You go, I mean, because this cannot fly. You can't do this to people, bro. Easier said than done. That's the thing, bro. But that's the thing, though. And to me, that's part of the reason why some of these motherfuckers, I just don't respect them. You go, I'm saying, everybody just mind their business claiming I'm a big dog, I'm a big dog, I'm a big dog. This is a culture that is still great and everything, yeah? And this is how you curate that culture. You stand you for have each to, other. You stand for each other. Yep. You protect it. You go, I'm saying, yes, the likes of Bonner Boys, Davido, Whiskeys, all these people. Yes, you cannot touch them because they already established an everything. But the up and coming ones, yep. the boys that are still, the ones that are still trying to find their yep. way, they got me. The 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 
bad boy teams of the world, the, you know, this guy right now, this more bad guy who just died, you know, like, you know, all these sort of people that are still trying to find their way, you have to protect them, You have bro. to, bro. There's, and there's so many of them, and it's sad, but it's how this one had this ending. But, bro, imagine the number of artists, up and coming that artists are going that, through have, shit. that are going through similar shit. Similar shit like this, bro. And everybody just keep quiet. Oh, no, it's not my business. You get me? And, and they know that this person or these people who they are whining and dining with, yeah, are bullying this boy. Are bullying this boy. And everybody just keeps quiet. This is not a white person doing it to you now. This is not a Chinese person doing it to you now. This is not an Indian person doing it to you right now. This is a fellow Nigerian. Fellow Nigerian. Okay, some of you are very tri tri tribalistic, right? This is a fellow Yoruba. You got know I me? Mean? Because, because I don't believe in the whole tribalism shit. We are all Nigerians and everything, but some of you play the whole tribalism game when it's very, very, very convenient to you Bro, and everything. That tribalism you, but that's too, my man. point. We're all African. But We're that's my point. We're all African. We're no, it's not about Yoruba, Igbo, Nigerian, But that is Ghana. my point. We're all African. But We're that's from my one point. continent. But some of them play political era and everything. You get me? All, all of them, we are playing the tribalistic game and everything. But you lot are still doing it to your own people, bro. And this boy just lost his life. After everything we've gone through. Lost, lost every, his everything we've gone through. Everything Africans have gone through. And we're still going through. Bro, it's a very dirty game, bro. Yeah. Nah, team pay me, bro. Team pay me. You get me? And, and, and like, I'm not even into his music like that. I know some of his music. Yeah, but, but he's a but, human being for sake. Yeah, but, but seeing what he went through and all that, and seeing people are aware of what this guy was going through because the evidence was there on social media. Nobody did fuck all. And then now he's dead. Everybody is trying to talk about it right now. All of a sudden, his music has gone to number one on Apple, Nigeria, wherever the case is. You lost some pieces of shit, bruv. You lost some pieces of shit over there. And, and that's the reason why I don't respect most of you lot over there, man. Because, you, some of, because most of you guys are evil. Evil people, bruv. You know what I'm saying? Bro, Most of you guys bro, are evil nah, people, bruv. See, this one, you know what I'm saying? No, nah, I need to leave. I'm on the team pay me, Joe. Yeah, team pay me, team pay me. That, team that, team I, 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 hope, I hope whoever is responsible for this, bro, is, is brought to justice. That's it. They have I to know, pay for it. Bro. I know that might never happen. You get me? But, bro, at the end of the day, God... Whether street God justice... Is our, God is our judge. Fam, God, what, God now our judge. Whether street justice or by the law or whatever, yeah... Whoever did that to that boy, I don't know who did it. I'm, I am not pointing fingers at, at anybody. I am not saying whether, whether it's Naira. And I don't know who don't did know. it. You don't know. I mean, you don't know. But you go, you're I mean, just going from, by yeah. what you've seen. But and the videos the that I saw, exactly. that video, exactly. those things should not even be happening in those videos. Mm -mm, mm -mm. Now, whatever caused his death and everything, we need to find out what happened to that kid. On God in heaven, we need to find out what happened but to that kid. He should have been protected we, more. He should have been, he should have been protected. That boy was going through shit. He was going through shit. And whatever happened to him, it's not fair. At all. At all. You know what I mean? It's not fair. At all, bro. Nah, rest in peace, Mobad. Rest in eternity. You know what I'm saying? Rest in eternity. Bro, God. the team, team paid me, John. Team paid me. God day, God, God day, bro. You know what I'm saying? L listen, bro. Let's, let's lighten up the mood a little bit. Bro, bro. what a way to start a podcast. I know, bro. fam. Yeah, 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 yeah. Fam. Yeah, yeah, listen, bro. We got that one out of the way, man. We got that one out of the way, bro. Go, go, no, be vodka. Mr. Money Ginger. I want me out of the waist time. Mr. Money Ginger. Bad ass tune. Bad tune. On God in heaven, though. On God in you heaven. You see that video of when he was performing at the O2 when everyone just went quiet? My man sat on the speaker. Oh yeah, oh yeah. And oh, then yeah, he yeah, just oh, sang yeah. it, bro. That was that was magical. Nah, that actually was sick though. <laughs> that that was actually was sick. Bad. And and I think he did the same thing as well in New York. In as New well. York, yeah. Bro, did you see his New York show? Bro, so, sold out, bro. Bro, 
<laughs> I know, they sold out like water, water, water. You get me? Sold out, bro. It's easy peasy. Easy peasy for Easy man, peasy bro. lemon squeeze. <laughs> <laughs> you got to say, dude is doing this thing, bro. But you know what? Another guy that is doing this thing, bro. Who's that? Shout out to Rema, bro. Shout Yo, out to Rema, bro. Shout bad out to boy Rema, Rema. Bad boy Rema. That boy, that boy said, how old is he? I don't even know. That's a very good question. Let me just double check. I think he's like 23 or something. Small boy. I think he's like 23. Let me just double taking check. Taking giant steps. Taking giant steps, bro. Taking, literally <laughs> taking giant steps, my see, guy. Bro. How old is Rema? It's a very good question. I've never... 23, yeah. 23. Yeah, I got that right. On the spot. On 23. The spot. Young boy. You get me? Listen, bro, for people that don't know, my man, dude is making the culture proud, 100, bro. 100, 100, 100. You go. what I'm saying? He's making the culture proud and everything. Rema's Calm Down has become the first track led by an African artist to join the Spotify's Billion Club, bro. Billion Club. You go. Know what I'm saying? If, if you don't know what we're talking about. One billion streams, One bro. One billion streams. That's crazy. That bro. is, bro, that is, fin- that is, that is mad. That's crazy. You're talking man. about not one million, not 10 million, not, not 100. 100 million. Not 100. Bro. One flipping billion. Do you know how billion many streams too, that is? That shit crazy, man. Bro, some artists, they struggle, get <laughs> that in their entire catalog. Good luck. You get me? In their entire catalog. What's the world population? (laughs) (laughs) Good luck. Bro, nah, that deep it though. That is mad. Bro, you know what, bro? And as you know, yeah, I'm not I'm not the biggest Rema guy like that. Yeah. There we go again. Yeah, no, no, no. No, 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 no. Hold on. I'm not the biggest in everything, but I've got to salute the guy, bro. No, you need to. Because you guys have been telling me, say, yo, this guy is the guy. He is the guy. You know what I'm saying? He's the guy. And so far, he is proven to be that guy. And for his... Bro, for 23 years old... For 23 years old, bro. How long has he been in the industry? Like five, six... Like six years, maybe? I'm not sure. Yeah, bro. Yeah. I mean, correct me if I'm wrong, but... I mean, bro, not that long. He's not been a, he's not been a business for long. Yeah, bro. He, he reminds me of Justin Bieber. He reminds me of Justin Bieber... He reminds me of Travis Scott. Whenever Travis I look Scott. at him, I, look, mm. I, I see that whole Travis Scott, that Travis whole thing. rave thing rave. on stage. Yeah, yeah. You me, which time you see with that fine boy, look, young boy, you yeah, get me, yeah, the yeah. ladies man, you get me, like, yeah. he's got, he's got, he's got suave. Yeah, of course he does. You know what I'm saying? That's why it reminds me of Justin Bieber. Like, he's just gone from a teenage sensation monster agent. sensation to this fine gentleman who's making big 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 splashes but you know what yeah the branding around him is crazy that's, the that's branding nice. around him is crazy because when i look at him and you see him on stage and everything the 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 um teddy bear mm. you know mm. the, the beginning of his song you, you hear another banger, another get, banger like whenever yeah. you hear that you know it's him bro we're quite we're, we're quietly waiting for him at the o2 as well yeah he's coming down bro. Coming, you bro i want to go the only thing that is holding me back a little bit, what? the crowd that will be there, I'm not so sure. Like, like you don't think it's going to sell it out? No, no, it's going to see. He's going to oh, sell okay, out. Okay, He's okay, going to okay. oversell out. Yeah, now, yeah, yeah. I'm thinking it might be like a much, much younger crowd. Oh, yeah, I get what you're saying. I, I get mean, what that, you're saying. that should yeah, not be yeah. a problem. I'm going there to enjoy Remy's music. Yeah, but, yeah, but I get what you're saying, though. Yeah. Like, the, the crowd might be very young. Yeah. I don't think so, you know, because Kelly is gone. <laughs> Kelly, if the Kelly don't go, like I go shoot <laughs> Kelly is gone. But Jeez. I get what you're saying though. Like his demographic are like the yeah. young, the young, young crowd. Young, yeah, young, young people. Well, that's but, what that's what we see. Yeah. That's what we see. It's, it's, it's just an assumption. If yeah. I, we might, I might be complete. We might be completely mm-hmm. wrong. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But yeah. Kelly, they go, yeah. Kelly said, "Guy, he's there." Bro, I might be there still. Kelly you know? said, "Guy, he's there." You go. I'm saying. Omo. But listen. Obviously, the news came out and everything, and he did this this video. Let's play it. And I'm here with Spotify for today's top hits. You know, the first Afrobeat song to ever hit a billion stream. That's huge. I'm grateful to God, you know, for the inspiration, for the grace, for the favor. You know, big shout out to everyone who worked hard with this one. Big shout out to Selena and her team and everyone who supported us to get this far. It's a blessing. It's not just a big one for me, my team, my family. It's also a big one for the culture. And I feel really happy. And I'm really proud of the fans as well for going back to the song, putting people on the song. And shout out to the DJ. Shout out to everyone who made this possible. 
Enough of shout outs, bro. Enough of <laughs> shout outs, bro. You know what I'm saying? My man shout everyone out and everything, man. They go on uh, me, but shout out to him though, nah, bro. Shout out to him. And I forgot to mention his speech at the um at the Hedy's Awards, bro. Oh yeah, he killed that as well. Yeah, he killed that, man. He killed that. Do you know what? I'm glad you said that though. Why you I'm glad that? you said that. A lot of people are saying, yeah, that they are positioning him. Now I do not know. But but a lot of conspiracy theories are saying that they are positioning him to be like that face of the culture slash Afrobeats yeah, because of the thing that's going on with I mean, with, with Homeboy. With homeboy. <laughs> you get me? With Bonaboy. Homeboy is just, he like, the Homeboy likes trouble. Homeboy is just a, he he, he, say we, he's it, just a bad boy. With, with, with Bonaboy because a lot of people are saying that, okay, that Rema is the next and everything because if you listen to, to his speeches and everything, even the one that he did, for people that don't know, he just won the best African um, music a, or something like that. Let, yeah. let me just find it real quick, Best bro. Best African there is, artist or something like that. There is bare, bare awards out there, bro. You know what I'm, saying? I'm just going to pull it up real quick. So he won the best Afrobeats at the VMAs with Selena Gomez, Calm Down. Okay, okay, okay. You know what I'm saying? Well, uh, which which award, awarding body? Um, that's MTV. MTV, okay, okay. Yeah, okay, so okay. so that's MTV v- VMAs. Okay, yeah, you yeah, go. Yeah. I'm saying, yeah, the best Afro beats and everything. Did you see the video? Nah, bro. Uh, you did not. I'm I'm just gonna play the video real quick, bro. Make 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 make, make see. Make, make, make see, just make see, see it real quick, bro. Make we just see that video real quick, bro. You got what I'm saying, but a lot of people are saying, yeah, that with that video, that it seems like he's he's positioning himself. I'm just find it. And he deserves it, man. The guy is... Oh, no, no, no. He deserves it. He's so calm. He deserves it. You cannot like, even take that away from he him. He comports himself well, well. Like, he's a gentleman. I'm not even talking about his music. No, I'm talking about him as a, as a man. Oh, yeah. He's a very cool like, guy. Cool guy. Like, cool, respectful guy, bro. Very cool guy. This, this is the video. Just hear it. Africa in the house tonight. First of all, I want to give big thanks to God. I want to give big thanks to my fans. Make some noise. I want to give big thanks to my team. Big shout out to Selena. I want to say I love you from the bottom of my heart. This means so much seeing Afrobeat grow this big and being here on this stage representing Afrobeat tonight. I'm so happy. But one thing I will not forget to do tonight is forget to shout out the people who opened the doors for me. Big shout out listen. to Fela, who started Afrobeat in the first place. <laughs> <You know? laughs> to Baba, Don Jazzy, the bands, the prince, Ron Town, Timaya, Two Face, Whiskey, Bona Boy, Davido. I'm a little lie, lie. And I want to give a big shout out to the new generation of Afrobeats. We're here to take it to the rest of the world. And one more time, make some noise for Selena Gomez. You see, you yeah. Me. yeah, go on. This guy, this guy gets sense. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Whoever, no, tra- this guy listen, gets sense. whoever trained him, trained him well. Bro, forget about any graduate you get with anybody or anything. He's doing it for the culture. He's doing it for the That's what I'm saying. That is... Bro, and that is magical. Yeah. Because all these names that he's mentioned, they do it for the culture, but sometimes they forget to mention... It's not like they don't forget. They always get some kind of beef. They always get some kind of like... They're rubbing shoulders with others, with, mm-hmm. their, with their other, you know, like uh, fellow artists. Mm-hmm. So they try to bring all the glory on them. Mm. But my man is there... He's spreading it out. Spreading it out. He's giving everyone their flowers. Giving everyone their flowers. Giving yeah. the top dogs their flowers. He yeah. understands. He knows his position. He knows his position. But he knows he's the next guy. But that's what I'm saying. He knows he's the he he knows he's becoming that guy. Yeah. That face. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah you yeah, know yeah. what I'm saying? Because I'm going through the comments, bro. You know me. I'm very petty <laughs> like that, bro. I'm going through the comments and see some comments that people are making there. You know what I'm saying? You know, and some people are throwing shots to burn and everything. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know, which to me, listen, everybody has their race. Everybody do their thing. Everyone want to craft their, their career how they want to craft their career. That's perfectly fine. Yeah, 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 you know yeah. what I'm saying? But I think he's positioning himself 
you know, for the the new generation, he's going to be the leader of the new school. You know what I'm saying? I think that's where he's pushing himself because someone like Bonner has made it clear that he's Afrofusion. <laughs> That's what I mean. Hey, yeah. you go. Know I'm saying he yeah. make I'm Afrofusion. I'm Afrofusion. You go. Know I'm saying so. This guy, when you listen to, he has done three statements. One at the head is one with Spotify, one with this one, and everything. And and he's, he's mentioning he, that yep. Afrobeats. Yep. He's championing Afrobeats. That beats. Afrobeats. He's not swaying away from it at all. You he's, go. I'm saying he's trying to tell you people that. It's all about Afrobeats. Yeah. That is the kind of music he's making. Yeah. And he's here to stay. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? And, bro, and and also at the head is an everything. He said something that just made me laugh. He said, you know, w- whether you do something to the Fed of, whether you do Afro this, Afro, Afro that, that, Afro yeah, that. Yeah, yeah, you know what I mean? Yeah, yeah, yeah. We, we will all assemble, assemble at the Afro, that, yep. at the Afro yeah. Beats Awards. Something <laughs> like that. You know what I'm saying? I say and you, see, but... <laughs> you see the way he gave credit to Hedis? Mm. I don't want to go back on that, but he gave credit to Hedis yeah. for championing the Afro the culture, yeah, the Afro yeah, Beats yeah. culture. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Which, bro... Nah, bro, I'm happy for dude, bruv. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm happy for dude. But let's get into the messy business, bro. Oh, messy be my guy is he's, he ain't got no messy business. I'm, I'm not guy. saying him though. Oh, 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 shit. You go, I'm saying. But before we jump on that, go bro, on. Ian Selena Gomez. Is that that something? is where I was oh, is going. That the messy to business you, you're going bro. to. <laughs> <laughs> Fam, have you seen the photos that I've been making rounds? Golly, now? I've seen I've seen a couple still. Yeah. I've seen a couple. Bro, some of the photos, yeah, that people have been kind of sharing and everything, yeah? Everybody's thinking, okay, what exactly is going on here, bro? Bro, they all want a bit of chocolate these days. You think so? Yeah, man. God, they've wanted it for time. So, obviously, we saw we saw this photo right here of him and um Selena, bro. Mm. She's holding on to... To his face. Mm. You get what I'm saying? Show not to his face. That is a face. cute, that is a beautiful picture. That's a very I'm not beautiful, even beautiful lie. picture. That, they, they make a, a, a beautiful couple. <laughs> <laughs> but I thought he's with Justin. Or rather, Justine. Bro, I... Well, that's what they say. That's what they say. Then there's this other picture and everything, yeah? Of her with her head on his shoulders. I, 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 think, it's, I think it's just... Brother, sister type. I, mean, I know. Say, wait, wait, wait. Hold on, hold on, hold on. You want to say if say she gets, she don't go splash. Oh, she go. Of course, she goes. Bro, they're, they're, they're on they're, this they're, chocolate. They're, bro, they've they've been on this chocolate team for ages. On, on this it's chocolate team. In yeah? the past, in the in the in the olden days, wait, huh? it wasn't it wasn't cool. It wasn't cool like that. Fam, but now, fam, it's always been cool. It's always it, been cool. It, it, well, they just hide it. They just exactly. That's what I'm saying. It Wait. wasn't cool to do in public, but now, bro. Let me see. <laughs> how, how old is Selena? She's 31. He's 20. I mean, listen. Ah, uh, bro. She's 31, bro. That's that's an eight year gap. That's not. That's that's, that's, that's nothing. Minor. That's nothing. That's that's, nothing. that's absolutely nothing. But, because, but personally, Wait, though, I, I I I feel like it's just. Uh, it's just a connection they've got. I don't think there's too much Cuzzy, to it. Cuzzy, 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 Cuzzy. She's... So, Justin Sky, who allegedly is with him, is 28. With her, yeah. yeah. And then, um, Selena's 31. He's 23. Fam, it, it, listen. Because there's this picture. I don't know if you saw this photo that actually circulated. I think they were somewhere backstage or whatever, and she was giving him a peck. She's been all over homeboy, bruv. I mean, he's the hottest Afrobeat artist. You got know I me. Mean? She's been all over homeboy. Like it's it's not just brother sister shit. Bro. Is that allow, not from, the, that that, not from their music video though? I think it was somewhere backstage, bro. I think so. I think so, bro. I think so. Like, bro, look look at this one right here, bro. Nah, that is a that is a cushy. She's comfortable with a the guy. Cushy bro. picture. But then, bro, come. I Me, mean, I don't know until I see something substantial. Yeah, of course, of course. Of course. Because you know, how, you know how these, you know how touchy, touchy, cuddly, cuddly they come. She seems like, like the type, though. Yeah, 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 she seems yeah, like yeah, the yeah. cuddly. You know. I mean, I mean, bro, I'm not mad at that, bro. I'm you know mad. what I'm saying? I, I don't so, think he's mad at that. That's what I'm saying, bro. But, <laughs> but then, if you're just in sky, you're gonna be mad at that. I mean, can you? I mean, you're going to be jealous, but bro, like... What are you going to do, though? You can't do nothing. <laughs> exactly. Can you be mad? That's what, that's what I'm thinking. 
<laughs> you're gonna be mad in in within you. You're gonna be mad. But yeah, bro, you're probably gonna what be can, What can it. you do? You can't do nothing. Like, come on, these two are untouchable right now, and I'm waiting. They need to drop another tune at one point, and I'm here for that. I'm here for that, but 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 they can't do. It, back it, to back, it no go. It no go be. It no go bang like. It, it, like no 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 no. It go bang. It go bang, but. I, I think it's a bit too soon, bro. Not now, not now, not now. Maybe like on, yeah, eventually, on, eventually. If Selena eventually. drops an album or if Rema like cut like something, yeah, something, yeah, something, if, yeah, eventually. They've got all the time to cook. Maybe they cook something. You know what I'm saying? But listen, bro. So, so do you think they don't smash before they they smash? Me. If you're to put your money on it, they, or they've nah, never they've smashed. Never smashed. You think so? Yeah, yeah I don't think they not sm- they've smashed. If you were in that position, you you could try smash. <laughs> <laughs> it's water wet. The thing is, yeah. <laughs> the way I got allowed, guys, is water wet. You bro. need to, you need to. If I was in that position, you need to read the room. Mm. I'm a reading nigga. Yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> nah, you need to read the room. Like, yeah, yeah, yeah. It, it, it's two things. If you feel like she's on the same. Wave, wave you. Is you. yeah. Just read the room, see, cause you, do you know, one go try something where she know they are comfortable with, and then it go come backfire, backfire, and then ruin a beautiful relationship that you guys have yeah, got. Yeah, yeah. So just read the room if she's on it. Mm. But the thing is, girls, girls like this, they piss me off, bro. Because because they will be leaning on you, hugging you up and everything, and you uh, you might be delusional and uh, for no, you yeah, know what, she's probably on it. You go try yeah, red, yeah. red red card, <laughs> massive red card. Yeah, bro. you can just get red card, you, bro. Bro, you go bite yourself in the time. Fam, like, what? Cause I've seen boys that it happened to, bro. Bro, it's happened to every. It's happened to me before. In bro. Fam, you have that friend. She's all yeah. over you all the time. She's hugging you up all the time. You get me? She she go. Lie down for your love. She go even tell you I love you. You get me? She go tell you I love your nerve and bro, you come for your mind. They think say, yo, it, I yo. probably got got a chance. It. She's you looking at you it. like a big brother, man. She's looking at you like a big bro, <laughs> big bro. You get what I'm saying? You go, you go do something. Record straight, bro. Some of them too, now mental problem. <laughs> it's true, bro. Some of them like you, but I don't even know what it is. I don't think I don't think so, bro. You don't think so? Nah, some some of them just take you as a brother, bro. It sounds like it's up into you bad times. <laughs> we we <laughs> so you're saying some of them, you're talking about yourself. <laughs> <laughs> big brother Toby. Yeah, some of you some of them take you as a big like, bro, bro. Big bro Toby, I told you we're my big brother. What are you trying to oh, do? Oh Charlie. <laughs> oh Charlie, you, you go there, they collect what they think. You think what you gonna talk, bro. <laughs> just make the whole shit fucking awkward, bruv. Fucking awkward. That's what ru- if the relationship is just that. Yeah, it'll bro. be awkward from that go. No, no. See, we all have been in that position when when I was younger and everything. You know, girl, they they friendly to you, to you set an opportunity where you won't slide and everything. But as I got older, bro, fam, hey, you get me? Just anything you, where they do, I'll just yep. give you space. You bro. know how to maneuver now. You like, just know how to maneuver, yeah, bro. Yeah, yeah. Again, because you don't want to get yourself into nah, some sticky, nah, sticky, nah, icky nah, situation. Nah, nah, nah. And at this point, let them come, let them take three steps towards you. And if, then, before then you, you take one, before you take or, one, or, or or like um, half steps, there. half a step, <laughs> you half a say. step, bro. Because yeah. these times you don't know. I'm telling you, you don't but, know. But you know what? Just like yourself, I don't think he's smashed though. I don't think it's smashed. I, f- yeah, I feel like they've yeah. got this strong bond, very good, very good bond, and yeah. everything. And considering what they achieved as well. Mm-hmm. You mm-hmm, know what I mean? Mm-hmm. Yeah. Nah, it's a beautiful mm-hmm. thing, man. Salute to the guy, bro. Salute to him. Nah, he's doing bits. Mm-hmm. Where the fuck is my clap? All right. There, there we are. Come there on. we are. There Come we on, are. guys. Don't, don't, don't sleep. <laughs> don't sleep. <laughs> Nobody to sleep for you. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Bro. But far, man, um, just before we leave, oh, did you see, um, first of all, Davido was in Manchester last oh, night shit. performing some intimate type thing. I think about a thousand three hundred to two thousand people and everything from what I heard it was packed out and that's, everything that's still in more. Manchester. That's yeah, still, that's still quite a bit. Yeah, on some on some intimate thing, obviously with with his um new album thing. Mm, mm, you know mm, what I'm mm, saying? Mm. So, so salute to him, bro. bro salute wait, to him. Uh, when did it wait? I want let's let's keep going. I just want to check something. I, I'm trying to remember when the album dropped exactly. 
I think the album dropped about like, was it two months ago, three months ago? Timeless, timeless, timeless. I think it was about two or three months ago, bro. Davido. March. Um, it dropped in first March. March. Ah, fuck it. Hell. Bro. March, April, May, June, July, August, September. Bro, nearly six months, you know. Fam, Five I and thought, a half months. Bro, I thought it was like about two, three months bro, ago, you know. Bro, same. Has it been that long? I'm looking at it in March. 31st Th- March. 31st of March. Shit. Bro, time they fly by, you know. And my man is still on the road performing, Doing, performing, yeah, yeah, performing. Yeah. yeah. You know what I mean? Bro, nah, he, nah he's been and, busy. And he's still been, doing interviews. Bro, he's been everywhere, bro. He he was at the VMAs as well, bro. Fuck me. He was at the B- VMAs and everything. Bro, he's been everywhere, bro. But he released a statement, right? He said, one of my greatest joys this year has been reconnecting with all of you doing my timeless tour because he's been in America. He's he's on the, um, a few dates over there. Mm. I've been humbled to see so many of you show up at sold out shows across North America and Dubai. The energy has been incredible. Bless you all. I am passionate about giving you a truly timeless experience every show, every time. One that all you lot deserve. So with this in mind, I've made the decision that after the show in Manchester, which is last night, I will be moving my remaining European dates until the first quarter of 2024. The additional time allows us to sort out some of the production issues we have been experiencing and gives us time to improve and create a bigger and more immersive show. Please accept my heartfelt apologies, but as I have said, there is a time for everything, and I believe that taking a um, a few months now to make your experience perfect will be time well spent. For anyone who has already purchased tickets, please hold on to new dates. Coming soon. Peace and love. Davido. Well, very well put. No, I love that. Very well said. I love that. I have learned not to question anything that has to do with production <laughs> logistics. Bro, you, after the last you, episode. You go learn. Ah, you go learn. <laughs> you yeah. go learn. Nah, bro. I remember a few times we've been here to say, ah, why did this? I remember when hey. Asaki cancelled. Um, who was it? Whiskey cancelled before as well. We say why? Say why? The, 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 the people have flown all the way from here. The, 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 bro, I've learned, bro. If if you're gonna if that's gonna improve your performance, if you if, if if that's gonna improve the the experience of the whole thing, bro, take your time. You mm-hmm. know what I mean? Mm-hmm. Some people online are saying that it's because he can't sell tickets. I don't. Really, no, no, no. I don't, I don't really that. believe that. I think Davido has a stronghold in Europe. You go, I'm 100%. saying. One hundred percent. He has a very big stronghold in Europe. <laughs> Bro, and what are you saying? So I'm sure he will be able to do that. You go, I'm saying. Now, if whether that's the case or not, I don't know. You go, I mean. But. If he says is production thing and everything, hey, bro, do your thing. You mm. go, I'm saying. But one thing that I'm, if if I ever meet Davido or if I know him, yeah, one question I would have asked him is, I think by now Davido should have had his own, his own band. You go, I'm mm. saying, because not because of born and everything. I've always known this. I've always known this, right? Having a, your own band, the synergy, the energy. You go, I mean, between the whole team, and it makes everything. But what if he he? What's this his band called again? What if he, like he he connects with them to on to to on a level that. Hold on, are you, are, you, are you talking about the composers? The composers, yeah. The composers are, tr- are contractors. They, I, I know they are contractors, yeah. but what I'm thinking is, what if, like, to him, like, they are the best of the best? Nah, like, nah. If, he feels nah. like... No, shout out to the composers, bro. They are doing their thing, but there's nothing like having your own band when they travel together, when they do everything together, when they practice together. You go, I mean, like, this is my thing. You go, know I'm saying, uh, bro. I think it's different, in my opinion. Mm. You go, know I mean, I think someone like him, somebody like Whiskey, they should have had their own band. But when, you, when you're inviting them, you're inviting them with their band. Mm, mm, you go, know mm, I mean, mm, if you look at someone like Bonner Boy, apparently at the moment he has a t- he has a 35 man band, bro. But you know, Benner is big on the whole stage crafting. That is, but that bro. Is, but that's what I know. Hey, I know. I know. That's that what makes is, him different from every other person. I know. Person, I know. But 
That's what makes him different from every other person. When you go to a bonus show and you look at that, you can tell, bro, it's a it's an art up mm, there. Mm, 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 mm. There's nothing like it. I've been there. I've seen it. There's nothing like that. You get know what I'm saying? You know, and and I think, I think someone like Davido, someone like Whiskey, that's gonna help elevate their craft a bit more. Yeah, a bit more. You get know what I'm saying? No, no, that's true. If they, they, confide, they but it's not easy to find the like find the bands that bro church, bruv. Church. Most, most of these people that are into the the shake they are all from from church. Because Ben, I'm sure it's taking him a while to like yeah. put, to put them together and then Yeah, it took him a while and everything from from what um from what Temidayo said and mm. everything, you know, just about two, three years ago was I think um I think sixteen or twelve man band to now thirty five. Thirty five. Thirty five or thirty six, there about. You get what I'm saying? Bro, even if you start from six or seven or ten, you it'll, get what I'm saying? Grow. It'll Fam, grow. It'll grow. It'll grow. Just, just allocate that responsibility to somebody that knows what they're doing there and that person can now recruit and all that. These people have the money to do that, you know, so that when, you know, Coachella's and some of these people yep. are inviting, yep. they are inviting yep. you and your band. You You're and your not band. going there to start, you know, what if the composers are busy, bruv? Yeah. Because I see the composers, they go play for Davido, then they yeah, go, go play, play for, for uh, Ashake, yeah. you know. And then now they even do their own shows as then well. Then they do their own shows and then, bro, I just think, you know. No, nah, no, nah, wait. For someone like Davido who, who also likes to be on the road performing and shit, that would make and, a lot of sense. And he has the money too, bruv. Yep. And he has the money yep. too and everything. You get me? He said, they, you know, this is my own band. You know, they specialize they in specialize whatever. They specialize in, in you your music, in on your, your stagecraft, on everything. Like, on everything, yeah, production, yeah, yeah, yeah. everything, bro. Yo, they're on full salary. You get what I'm saying? Yeah, that's it, bro. You get me? That's nah, it. Nah, that makes sense. That makes sense. You know, I Thanks think that's going to help it. elevate his, his, his shit, man. You know, but but listen, shout out to him though. Nah, shout out to Davido, man, bro. Shout out to him. If you feel like you need to take some time off, take your take some time off and do your thing. Yep, do your thing, man. The fans ain't going nowhere. They ain't going nowhere, bro. They will always chill and watch you. Yep, they'll rather have you perform at your best than come and do a quick shady thing and then keep keep it. Yeah, 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 man. You know what I'm saying? But bro, did you see um, Bonaboy's big burner, big seven the other day, man? Talking about contracts and that, bruv. Big seven. You get what I'm saying? Big seven <laughs> say what? Uh, uh, uh. <laughs> he said, with the numbers I'm seeing on this contract. You know where kill me. You keep going. Keep going. These next years of my life are about to be really... No, hold on. This, this next years of my life are about to really show if I really love doing music or if I'm about the bag. God must really want to test my love for music. Laughing emoji. I just might bounce on y'all like Rihanna did. That's what killed. That's what killed me. <laughs> but that's a fact. <laughs> that is what killed me. But that's a fact, bro. We're not, bro. We're not done with you yet. <laughs> <laughs> Rihanna nah, was like, nah, 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 "Fam, nah. listen, bro. This was what Rihanna did, bro. bro. And bounce, bro. bro. Once she became a billionaire, she was like, was "Music, it. what? Music, what? Fenty." Is giving me whatever I need right now. Hmm. Music, what? Didi did, did the same thing. Didi became a billionaire to um, Ciroc and Delion or whatever. Bro, bro, bro. He, he bounced. Once he started having um, 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 issues with, I believe, Ciroc or whatever, because mm. they, they are in court right now. His, his album is coming out. This, I believe, this Friday. I think tomorrow. Is it tomorrow? Yeah, yeah, tomorrow he, is yeah he's dropping yeah, a new yeah. album and everything, bro. You get me? Some of these people, 50 Cent, the same thing. Bro, but some have done it and failed. Some have tried and failed, though. Like what? Try to start businesses, mm. quit music and start businesses and failed. Yeah. yeah. It happens. Maze tried it, apparently. Um, what business did, did, did Maze try? Right? Maze wanted to be a pastor. No, bro. no. After that, when you remember he came back into the music industry yeah. and he quit again. Apparently, he tried a business. Uh, I can't remember. And then it didn't know. really fly. This guy too, I don't know if you can remember him, Camilonier. But Camilonier is doing well though. Apparently, he's... Mm. No, 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 no. Apparently, bro, he is main table. He's one of them guys. He's one of them guys that cashed out. That cashed out. What? Mm. He's one of them guys that cashed out, bro. Yeah. He's Nigerian, bruv. 
Yeah, no, no, no. Smart no, guy. No, 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 <laughs> guy. Go, go. No, but some of them have tried and failed. Go read him up. He cashed out, bro. He cashed out big time. He's, 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 he's doing well. True. He got nah, you, you just need to, you know, just be a bit calculative on when. But, bro, now, nah, Bernard is Bernard right now. Like, <laughs> household name. <laughs> but if you're the record label right now and you're sitting facing burner right now, yeah, you're not going anywhere, <laughs> <laughs> bro, bro, bro. No, 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 bro. To me, yeah, I know a lot of people are saying this that he's rich his peak, he's not rich his peak yet. Nah, bro, bro, there's so much more to there's so much more room to grow, fam. Open check, bro. Ah, guy, how much you want? Relax, Bernard, relax, relax. Open check, you bro. just took off, you literally just relax, bro, fam. The same thing that they did for Drake. Apparently, mm. I think Drake signed some 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 Nest deal, or I think five hundred million or something like that. some Nest deal, the biggest deal in hip hop right now. You get what I'm saying, bro? I would, if if it was me, <laughs> I said, Bernard, what do you need? <laughs> yeah, what do you need? <laughs> okay, this is the deal that I'm gonna do for you right now. Yeah, I'm gonna give you open check and all that. Yeah, and then after how, however years you can get get your masters and your polishes back. Bro. Yeah, yeah. Who, who is this sign? Is it Atlantic Records? Yeah, I think Atlantic. I think Records. it's Atlantic Records. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let me just double check. I might be wrong. I don't want to say the wrong thing. Even though, listen, if you're looking for fact checking on this podcast, we we don't do it over here, bro. He <laughs> gave me so for for some of you. For the, listen, for some of you that come to me and be like, do your research. Listen, bro, for some of them that, that, that come and, and tell me, do my research, I, I say if that's going to hurt me. Nope. <laughs> but we stand corrected. We stand corrected. I do not. <laughs> <laughs> hey, you got me. If I say something, I said it, bro. You got me. With your chest, Dobby. Even if I'm wrong, I'm right. You're right. <laughs> you get, you get, even, even if, if I'm you get, even wrong, I'm right. Even if even I'm wrong, I'm I'm right in my head, bro. <laughs> it gotta be if you wanna if you, you wanna do do research, go and do research, you bro. Know what, you. I know they do the research, bro. <laughs> it gotta be that like crazy. Yeah, okay, yeah. He he's with um Atlantic, Atlantic Record. Care. Yeah, okay, okay, cool. So he's got spaceship, bad habit, Atlantic, shit. Mm. Then they said, um, 2023 spaceship under exclusive license to Atlantic Recording Corporation for the world, excluding Africa. Hmm. Excluding Africa. I yeah. wonder how that works. So I think Atlantic is probably everything that's happening outside of Africa. Mm. They are probably the ones handling it. Then maybe the spaceship. Uh, um, bad habit are probably hunting Africa. I don't in know Africa, how that shit works. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You got know I me? Mean? No, but no, you, no. But make you relax, bro. He still got a good, good. good oh, he's not going nowhere. Bro. Oh no, 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 no. He's not going nowhere. But I feel like maybe he's trying to tap into like different, different industries, different businesses. Oh, maybe as, as he should. Or maybe he's trying to strong arm. The, the the record label the record label bro <laughs> say listen hey I know my worth you now. got me I know my worth bro <laughs> you guys got pattern yeah, up bro you need to pattern it up you need to you re need up, revisit this contract too yeah yeah wow. yeah yeah you get me nah nah bro the guy's got he's got the upper hand right now he's got the upper hand bro he's, he's the guy right he's now he's a guy he's the guy right now he's, they need to give a, him open he, check he told bro. you look put my name on your song and it's a hit and that's a fact, bro. This he is proved a hit. It. He <laughs> proved it. Me, over bro. and over. He proved I'm it. I'm just waiting for all these, particularly all these hip hop artists. I'm just waiting to see how many of them go put Bernard on their albums. Shit, I think you probably heard, heard it here first. Mm. I think DJ Khaled's next album. He's going to be on that shit. What about go there? Yeah, and that's what DJ Khaled does, isn't it? Yeah, that's what he does, bro. He scouts the best of the best. That guy. I've never <laughs> seen nothing like that dude before, bro. Bro. He, so, will, he will go and find you, bro. He's a guy that will have Justin Bieber and then, and then, oh, what's this guy's name? You have like two big dogs on one song. On one song. Justin Bieber, Future, Fu bro. Future, maybe Lil, Lil Duck or something. Charlie, bro. Charlie, that guy. <laughs> that yeah, guy is it. The guy that they hear, bro. That guy. So, yeah, yeah, nah, nah, wait, wait. But I'm sure a lot of other artists are going to follow suit. Yeah, of course, bro. You, you get me? Of course. They are going to follow suit because Ben is a guy right now. You get me? Nah, nah bro. You, you know, you know, take care of that guy, bro. The contract, the contract, bro. We don't even know. We don't need story, bro. We need yeah. music, bro. And this is a funny thing, but I don't. Know is it was rumored when he split up with um Steph, innit? Apparently, Steph was throwing shade on him and then mentioned something like 
he's he's egotistic and that uh, mm. um he just um he's jealous of how big his friend Whiskey is mm. and that he will never he will never be as big as Whiskey. Mm. I don't know how true this is. I'm not even listening to none of that bullshit. But that said. is what apparently that's what she said mm. when they first broke up and mm. all of mm-hmm. that. Yo, she go to sit there. Fab, <laughs> fab. That's that thing is the equivalent, right? Of when you break up with a girl and she said, Oh, he's gay, by the way. He gonna say, Oh, 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 he oh. he he has a small day. Yep. That's, that's, that's what I was gonna say. Oh, oh he has oh, a small day. Oh, he never satisfies me. Oh, he anyway. never satisfies Oh, for real? <laughs> oh, for real? So I did not satisfy you for ten years, yo, and you were here. Yo, God, I don't know if that's true, but that's why I had. And but if he, if she did say that, yo, she would be oh, kicking herself she, now. Yeah, man. fam, she's kicking. Uh, well, I don't know, but listen, my my guy elevated. That that's what 100, I know. 100, 100, 100. He he's, elevated. That is what I know. He's gone from fifty to a hundred real what? quick. He real elevated. Quick. That is what I know. Two years straight, bro. He's doing this thing, bro. And shout out to Whiskey, bro. He, you know, obviously his mom died and everything. Oh, but shit. But pictures came out. He was at a fashion fashion thing. Was it yesterday or today? And everything for the first time that he's coming outside. So shout out since, to him, since, since, since his mom passed. Yeah, yeah, it? yeah, yeah. Shout out to him, though. No, you get no, me? No. Yeah, bro. Nah, fam. It's been a good one, though. As always. It's as been always, a good one, bro. Guy, you get me? It's been a good one and everything. You know, wishing everyone, you know, peace and love and everything. I know we started off in a mournful way, but... Yeah, bro. It had to be done, man. But, bro, it they need to, to do done. the right thing, bro. People need to learn. They People need to need to be the right yep. thing. They need to be held accountable for shit like this. People need to learn. This cannot keep repeating itself. Watch you guys. Watch you guys. Did to more bad was not fair. What you guys did to more bad was wrong. You get what I'm saying? That is, I and I stand by it. That should not have happened in our culture. That's not the way we should be moving. We should be moving together and building this culture. Mm-hmm. You get what I'm saying? What you guys did to that boy was wrong. And whoever did that, I don't know who did that. I don't care what the blogs are saying because none of us were there. But whoever did that should pay for it. Whoever did that should be excommunicated from the culture. Mm. You know what I mean? Nobody should have nothing to do with him. Mm. You know what I'm saying? There is absolutely no reason that kid, that boy should die the way he died. Nope. Really bad. No one deserves that. Really wrong. No and one deserves everybody that. Everybody that knew about that, that saw what was going on, that knew what was going on and kept quiet. If it was your family member, would you have done that? No. You get me? But I'm not here to preach anyways. You go what I'm saying? Bro, should we call you a day, yeah? <sighs> might as well, bro. Might yeah? as well. Might as well. Might as well. It might as well end, end the shit. Well, you go what I mean? Thank God it's Friday. You in, know, tomorrow. In a, cu- in a couple of hours. In a couple of hours in that film, bro. Any plans for the weekend or what? Bro, oh, yeah, I'm, you're traveling. I'm, I'm traveling, man. I'm, I'll be, I'll, guy, I'm, I'm waking up at like three in the morning on Sunday, man. Bouncing, yeah. I've got a flight to catch. But yeah. Shit, bro. There you go, man. Yeah. man, man. A man is going to go, you know, get some tan on that, bro. That's a good time, <laughs> bro. Bro, this heat has already tanned my skin. Uh, true. I'm telling you. True. Uh, yeah, I'll be I'll be I'll be under the shade. I'll be wearing a hat. I'll be hiding under there. You know when or you both people will come out. I need to catch a time. Right? Nah, I'll be, I'll be I'm under, under the shade, bro. I'm good. <laughs> I'm good right here. I'm bro. under the cubana. I did I did such shade. Oh God in heaven, I'm good right here, bro. You get what I'm saying? Fam, should, should we should we call you a day, yeah? Yes, 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 people. All right then, people. Salute to you guys out there, man. Yep. Make sure you subscribe. Salute all the freshers. Love. Make sure you share this video yep. or rather this episode. Watch the videos. Leave a like. Leave a comment. Share it. Tell a friend to tell a friend. Or tell an enemy to tell a friend. Because they got friends. Freshers too. for life. Yes, sir. And Are you a fresher? Then subscribe. Subscribe. Press subscribe. the button right now. Press the button right People now. People that just go on YouTube just to watch. You just go go YouTube. Enter fresh of the boot. Just subscribe. Press the button right now. You get me? You get what I'm saying? And also... Also, we are also on the audio platforms as well. Spotify, Apple, Google Podcasts, anywhere where you find us, we're there, man. Mm-hmm. You get what I'm mm-hmm. saying? Mm-hmm. If you want to listen to the audio episodes, 
for the audio experience and everything, we are right there. We bro. did it. You know what did I'm saying? It. We've got some big interviews coming. Yep. You know what I'm saying? Some of them are going to be um, right in the studio. Mm. Some of them are going to be via Zoom mm. or Teams. Mm. You know what I'm saying? Paul. I'm sure you guys are going to uh, enjoy it. It was still going to be the same experience. The same experience, enjoy it still. You know what I'm saying? Yes, sir. Fam, should we leave you, yeah? Yep. Love and peace. Love and peace, bruv. You get me.